you know there are people who like to see their name every place and they can get the name in the paper by being scandalous or they can make up some sham whatever I'm going on a trip to Africa and I'm going to take care of it and all that and then there are genuine celebrities let's take Oprah she is unbelievable in the way she may, she empowers people. She makes other people feel that they can do more with their own lives. She gives them the self-confidence so that they can have greater self-esteem. And this is such a gift, aside from the fact that she's given over 30 million and she's done wonderful things. But um, it's also this whole double theme not only philanthropy, but giving to others, empowering others. This is a tremendous thing. Now, another example is Paul Newman. He established uh, a salad dressing company, Paul Newman's own, and he said all the profits were going to charity. And by now, uh, more than $300 million have gone to charity, to hungry people to people who really are destitute, whatever it is. So he's setting an example. Now, I was delighted to see that his name came up uh, in the current issue of Town and Country with Hugh Jackman from Australia, because Hugh Jackman has another food preparation, and he has declared that all the profits from the sales of these goodies will go for charity. This is what we hope for, that, uh, that somebody will wholeheartedly give of himself or herself, and that there will be a constant chain, that people will encourage others to be like them, so that everyone benefits. The people who give, the people who receive, and the rest of us who begin to get ideas, you know, maybe I, sh I could do more, even with my uh, little specialty cake, whatever it is. But if I have a bake sale and other people come and other people contribute and we all give to a charity in the community or something that we believe in.